All right, welcome back to my Sith and Quizzed at Walkthrough. I took a little bit of a break, and I actually came back four days later or three days later. I don't know. I came back to a XP event. This is the best time to start a character in this game or to start playing the game if you want to level up fast because you get 100%. Well, this is this actually says 200% XP boost. So, yeah, your XP is going to skyrocket, my guy. You need to, uh, you need to hop on <laughs> if you haven't already, of course. But last episode, hold on, let me recap. Last episode, we got on, uh, we got that machine, machine, uh, Sith guy who tried to press us and kill us. Well, he, he tried to intimidate us for our, ma our master, you know, to, to get mad. Lord Sash, I think her name is, to get mad. That didn't work because we wasn't scared. But actually, we we went on, on a mission to acquire a, a device to help us kill him. So here has... <laughs> Here it is, this little chamber is over here. We're gonna go end his life for trying to punk me. I slept. I can't wait. I see. Nothing yet. What makes this slave so bold as to enter my chambers? Tell me, slave. Are you insane, or do you have a death wish? My master wants you dead, and I must comply. Skisk. <laughs> Kill her. I'm your master now. <sighs> Clever. Zash must have stayed up many a night to think of that one. I suppose you'll be sending my bodyguards away now, or maybe you'll order them to kill me. You're free to leave any time. <laughs> You shouldn't have done that. The bodyguards, they're nothing. Show. But you subverted my authority, took my slaves from me, and that makes me angry. And killing you will be over too soon. No. I think you're going to have to suffer first. Oh, uh, damn. He just did that. Okay. I didn't... He just slapped him up so easily. I mean, I could have probably done that too, but like... That was a good show of power, even though he about to die to me. You ain't Darth Vader, nigga. I will slap you up. I'm still not familiar on how to use this combat class, but I'm doing my best, though. As I said, obviously, I'm trying my best to use this. <laughs> what is this? Ha! Huh. Did you... Whoa. Zash! Zash! You've killed me! Weaklings are like clay in my hands. Mindless. You don't know what Zash can do. Think. Think of how many years she must have spent plotting my death. She will kill you just like she's killed me. I killed you, not Zash. <laughs> right? Stop bringing her into the equation. I did that. The combat, everything was me. Me, 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 me. All right, let's go. Nexus Room Cantina. To report to our guy, well, our lord, master. 
that the deed is finished. I don't know what you're saying to me, I mean. Then why do we waste our time in this place? Calm down, nigga. We're just about to go uh, tell our master that the, we, we've done it. Just like how you uh, would go back to Tula Court to tell him you killed whoever he asked you to kill. I noticed this this monster is always he's always bitching about something. You know what? <laughs> he's always bitching. Well, when I'd heard she'd taken up with a Mandalorian, I was scandalized. Just scandalized. A Mandalorian? Does nobody value Sith blood these days? I know, I know. Don't you think so, Zash? The places I means why high fools go and did a seek from Tauhans. I'm sorry. Will you excuse me? I need to have a quick chat with my apprentice. If you must. Now, as I was saying. Thank the Emperor you've arrived. It doesn't matter how much one drinks. These parties are just dull, 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 dull. I hope you've come to cheer me up. I have dismantled the machine. He's dead then? Excellent. You have performed magnificently, Apprentice. None of this would have been possible without you. Lord Zash. Darth Vanaton, I'm honored. Don't let me interrupt you. Don't go anywhere just yet, Apprentice. This call won't take long, and I have some further instructions for you. As I said, my lord, I'm honored, but why call me? You have nerve, Zash. Nerve. But I thought you were smarter. With all respect, Darth Thanaton, I don't know what you're talking about. Don't play ignorant with me, Zash. Scotia's dead, and you killed him. Scotia? Dead? That's the first I've heard of it. When did this happen? Just now, Zash, and you know it. What did you expect to gain? His position? His title? You know it doesn't work that way. Where's your discretion? Discretion? I've been at this party for ages. I may have had a little much to drink, but I'm fairly certain I haven't murdered anyone. Though I have always fancied Scotia's chambers. So much more shelf space. Zash, I don't want to have this conversation by hollow. Report to my chambers immediately. Yes, Darth Anaton. It'll be my pleasure. What was that all about? Give me time to talk to Thanaton, and then meet me in Darth Scotia's chambers. And don't worry, you played your part, now it's time for me to play mine. We did it, Apprentice. <laughs> As we should. So, okay. We just have to fast travel back. Dang, so that was the Darth guy. I guess he's sitting on the dark, uh, dark council. Oh, excuse me. It's been weeks and I'm still coughing my lungs out. Oh, Jesus Christ. Hopefully I don't have COVID. I mean, I, don't, I know I don't have COVID. It's just a little cough. But we have to go to this former chamber. I guess he's, um, I guess she's in his chambers now. Like she got promote, she got a promotion or something, thanks to us, of course. Hopefully, I, I think. Oh, I see Nemo. There, there she is. It's Lord Zash's apprentice. Surely she knows. You wouldn't tell us if she did. What binds Brigan Iswis Buidan? Still, it doesn't hurt to ask, does it? Can let it rest. I will not let it rest. Everyone knows Lord Zash was at the party when Scotia was killed, and yet everyone knows she killed him. She somehow devised a way of being in two places at once. If I let it rest, we'll all be dead. That's why I'll never tell her secrets. Good idea. Don't tell him anything, Apprentice. But I must know. Please, you must tell me. How did Zash kill Darth Scotia? Actually, I killed Scotia. Clearly, she's not going to tell you, Kiernan. Let it rest. Fine, then. Fine. But I'm warning you, Calaveras. Lord Zash is becoming too powerful too quickly. Since when has anyone in the history of the Sith committed a murder so brazenly, yet made it appear that she was somewhere else the entire time? It's enough to wake the Emperor, I tell you. I mean, I guess it's a good thing that they don't believe that I killed him. 
but like at the same time, like nigga, I did that shit. I, I want the credit for it, you know? I'm selfish. Perfect timing, apprentice. I just met with that insufferable Thanaton, and I have good news. Everyone's talking about how you killed Scotia. Good. Let them talk. They can't prove anything, and it'll drive them mad. And my meeting went exactly as I planned. You would have been proud of me. I went into a reprimand, but I emerged a Darth. Do I get a promotion too? For now, you remain my capable apprentice. However, a Darth can raise an apprentice to a Lord, so your prospects just improved. Remember the map you found on Korriban that pointed us to the power of Tulak Horde? The first piece of that artifact, that power, is here on Drummond Kaas. This piece is in the deepest chamber of the Dark Temple. Scotia always hoarded the key to the chamber like a hut hoards his credits. Now I have Scotia's title, his chambers, his research, and his key. He always said I would enter the Dark Temple over his rusting corpse. However, I won't be the one to go into the Dark Temple. You will. It will be my pleasure. Before I went to Korriban to choose an apprentice, a furious apparition awakened in the Dark Temple, implacable in its anger, murdering all who trespassed on the innermost chamber. But I had a dream. An apprentice of low origin humbled himself, or herself as it happened, before the apparition, pacifying it. That's why you and your peers were chosen. I always knew I was special. You've been a far more capable apprentice than I ever hoped. But for this task, you must put aside your pride. You must go into the temple and face the apparition. And when you do, I believe that your humility will be the key. Still, I want you to know, I'm not certain you're the one from my dream. I fear I may be sending you to your death. You're a Sith. Start acting like one. You're right. You retrieved the Holocron from Korriban when no one else could. If that's not proof of your destiny, I don't know what is. Tulak Horde's power awaits us both. We must not lose sight of this goal. Use this glyph to enter the innermost chamber of the Dark Temple. Humble yourself before the apparition, and bring back the piece of the artifact. <laughs> Uf Dundan Ja Adnam in Puidangarja. Alright. Look how she tried to sneak in. A little um a little weird little weird little um I kinda of felt like a motivator, like 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 a I don't think you can do it. You know, like some type of motivational it's not motivational, but it's like I can't explain it, but Oh fuck. It's kind of like reverse psychology type shit. Like, oh, you can't do this. And then I, like, you tell me I can't do something, then I, I decide to uh, go ahead and prove you wrong. Something like that. Ready for departure. If you, if you get it, you get it. I'm sorry, I'm trying to explain this shit. Enjoy your stay. All right, nice. Destination? It's going to be a long taxi ride, I'll tell you. Whew. All right, we're close enough now. I wonder if um the Dark Temple is still in canon or somehow in canon. I couldn't tell you. I couldn't even tell you if Droman Kass is in fucking uh is in canon. It probably it probably is. It's just like um an abandoned planet like uh like Ilum and Hoth and stuff like that. Maybe it is. Maybe it isn't. Or maybe it's still the homeworld of the uh, of the Sith. I still haven't made my way around to watch uh, um, the trilogies and stuff like that with Anakin, Obi Wan, Luke. I know what happens, but I don't. You know, I haven't watched it. I would make my way uh, around to watch. I was told to watch. Ah, um, oh, fuck! I couldn't tell you the title, but uh, it was one like it was like a specific scene with. Uh, they were having a whole war on Alderaan, and, uh, Jar Jar Banks was in it, Princess Leia, Han Solo. 
Fuck they were uh, on the ground fighting. It looked like a war. They were fighting droids and stuff like that. I couldn't tell you which one it is. I think it's Phantom Menace, but I'm not sure. I was told that's like the it's like the best order to watch it. What is this? Force from Generation. Oh, okay. Dang, why I gotta be all the way over, over here? <laughs> is it an instance? It's not an instance. Oh, fuck. Alright. I'm gonna stealth my way through this whole thing. Because I don't feel like getting into squabbles in the Dark Temple. It's not happening. Just run through now. Oh, oh, fuck me. Oh, I thought he still. I thought he still aggroed me. I was still. I was so confused. Cause that move uh, makes me. It takes me out of combat. Don't put that back. It takes me out of combat and uh, deaggros the the mob I'm aggroing. I don't think it works on an instance like this. Like. Uh, instance like this but maybe it does who knows I, I couldn't tell you honestly talking about ah, you don't know me has our family fallen so far that the daughter of my daughters does not know the name of Kallik the name so long revered in the annals of the Sith you are my descendant by how many generations I do not know but know this your strength in the force has awakened me from my stupor what do you mean, I awakened you? When the weaklings of this planet trespassed my tomb, I rose, resuming my former life. This temple became my kingdom, and I was once more a lord of the Sith. But when you first grasped the hilt of your lightsaber, I knew my hour had come and gone, that your strength, not mine, would return our family to glory. I'm going to return our family to glory. Our family was torn from greatness, crushed by the treachery of another, a man named Tulak Horde. The places Amin's Waihai's fools, go and did a seek from Tauhans. Ha! Your master is dead, beast. You serve the child of Kalib now. Flesh of my flesh, you should teach your servant to obey. I defeated him once. I can control him. Such confidence. Such pride. In restoring our bloodline to glory, you must not make the same mistake. Treachery is the Sith's endless game. You must win it. Don't worry about me. Beware your master. Beware your apprentice. Never be taken by surprise. Do these things, and you will be unstoppable. 
But you have not come to see me. You have come for the artifact I managed to wrest from Tulak Horde before he died. Take the artifact, but be careful. I know not what it does. Only that betrayal follows it everywhere. It wouldn't be worth taking otherwise. Just keep your eyes open. I hunger for the day when our power will be restored. We will meet again. Oh, okay. So that's our ancestor. Ancient ancestor. Ooh. Apprentice, do you have the artifact yet? What do you think? Of course. Brilliant. Magnificent. Hurry back to Scotia's, I mean, my chambers. I cannot wait to see this artifact. And I have a surprise for you. I love surprises. Trust me, you'll love it. Now hurry back with the artifact. I can't wait. I knew I was a god. Hey, so that guy is our ancestor, okay? And he's telling me to beware of my master and my apprentices. I mean, that is a uh, that is kind of known though. That Sith <laughs> Sith always betray uh, every everyone. But I will master. I, well, not master. My ancient ancestor. I will. Hey, and they telling me. Uh, I have low birth. Nigga, I have Sith ancestry in my blood. I guess I just, uh... I guess my mother was just an alien and she got blown back. I mean, like she got her back blown. Fantastic, Apprentice. You're just in time for my surprise. Since you left for the Dark Temple, I've been reading and reading and reading. Scotia's chambers are a treasure trove of research. Now, who would have thought a man like that had such a curious intellect? It almost makes me regret that we had to kill him. But let me see this wonderful artifact you found. It's right here. Have it. Excellent. Magnificent. It all begins here, apprentice. But tell me, how did you manage to pacify the apparition? Apparently, he was my ancestor. Remarkable. A slave's lost ancestor turns up in the Dark Temple, and I sense your incredible destiny doesn't stop there. I've been studying Tulak Horde's artifacts closely for some time, and one glance at this one you've brought back confirms everything I've suspected. These artifacts will change everything, Apprentice. You especially. They will make you more powerful than you could imagine. I have foreseen it. What do the artifacts do, exactly? This artifact is one of five that together describe a peculiar ritual used by the great Tulak Horde when he conquered the Droman system. Until I have all the artifacts, I cannot understand the full nature of the ritual, but I have foreseen that you alone will wield the ritual's power. The artifacts are scattered across the galaxy, some hidden by Tulak Horde himself and some wrenched from his hands by betrayers. Documents in Scotia's effects point to Balmora and Narshada, but I will need to do more research to locate the other two. I'll get started right away. It's not much to go on, but I will continue my work behind the scenes to get you more information. But first, I believe I mentioned a surprise earlier. If you're going to find these artifacts, you'll need a ship, and so I have ordered you one. All you need to do is pick it up. For me? You're too kind. Yes, you've earned it. You'll find your ship at the spaceport. Then the galaxy is yours to explore. Don't forget to contact me when you reach each planet for more information on the artifact's locations. Good luck and good hunting. <laughs> Yeah, I know, I know. 
I know, don't worry. If she tries some bullshit, her time must come. I have to go to the hangar now, okay? Um, why is this here already? Wait. All right, let's go to the hangar. Spaceport right here. And it, it is kind of handy to have uh, this guy with you at all times, cause he's like a he's like a attack dog. If I don't like the way you're looking at me, best believe you end up in this tummy, boy. I'll tell you. That's why people can't. Well, I can't be a Sith in real life. If I had uh, this much power, bro, <laughs> I'm, I'm not gonna be. I'm not gonna be like a like a dickhead or anything. Just don't. Uh, just know I ain't paying taxes. That, <laughs> that's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> ain't no way I'm paying taxes. I'm gonna be a good Samaritan, good everything. I'm just not paying taxes. Oh wow, okay, so that was it, I guess. Let's hop on our ship over here. Why is it telling me to go to Baltimore already? Like the same thing with the Nasher Aquas. We are gonna go Nasher Aquas uh, first, though. Now that I've looked at the ship, I think this is the uh, the same ship. Oh, ah. I mean, greetings. I am 2VR8, that totem droid for this vessel. You must be my new master. Gentle, kind new master. So, I get a starship. And a servant, too. Not bad at all. I am relieved, uh, uh, pleased that you find me agreeable. I will never disappoint you, Master. I am programmed for a wide array of tasks, including but not limited to meal preparation, ship maintenance, janitorial duty, and etiquette. Welcome aboard this Fury Class Imperial Interceptor, a versatile craft combining a starfighter's maneuverability with armament to rival larger military vessels. You'll find all of the standard amenities, including your own private captain's locker for storing valuables. The astrogation console contains a constantly updated map of the known galaxy. Interstellar communications are accessed via the ship's holo terminal. Priority alerts that you may find useful are available from the Imperial Holonet console. Lastly, the ship's intercom will inform your crew that you wish to issue new orders. Any questions, Master? I have a mission to complete. Time to see what this ship can do. Thank goodness you aren't deactivating me. I mean, good luck. I regret I am unable to offer you combat support, Master. Frankly, my chassis couldn't withstand the stress. However, should any errands arise that are beneath your superior status, please do not hesitate to call upon me. I function to serve you. Whenever you are ready to depart, consult the galaxy map on your bridge. It will program the proper astrogation coordinates and activate the engines. What I was saying was, I noticed, not like, now that I'm actually looking at this, I'm actually noticing that this is the same ship as the Sith Warrior ship. <laughs> you can't tell I've been playing this game for fucking uh, 13 years. Not 13 years, uh, 8 years. That's if my math is correct. Seven to eight years. Well, let's just round it up to that. But I am going to end the episode here, though. So I'll catch y'all boys in the next one.